Hi, welcome to Cook with Gary. Today we're going to make a large batch of vegetable soup. Here is the selection of vegetables I'm using today, but of course you can use your favourite vegetables. We're using a 7 litre pot, which is great when making a large batch, which we can then freeze later in portions. So for the base of this soup, I'm using onions, garlic and a selection of fresh herbs. First of all, cut your onions. Crush the garlic with the back of a knife and chop roughly. If you don't have a garlic crusher, use a little bit of salt and drag the back of the knife to puree the garlic. Then chop your celery. The next stage is to chop your herbs. If you don't have fresh herbs, dried herbs will suffice. When you're cutting the herbs, if you roll them all in a tight ball, chop them like this, it's much, much easier. Now, we sweat off the onions, garlic, celery and herbs. Slowly on a medium heat until soft. And keep your eye on it, don't let it burn. Keep it moving. Chop up your peppers. I prefer to do these upside down, it's way easier to cut through the skin. Chop up your carrot and parsnips. Now you can peel your sweet potato, chop it up. Vegetables like turnip and butternut squash are way better to use a knife to peel. Chop your broccoli, holding the stalk, pushing the knife away from yourself. Base of the soup is ready, you can add all this veg in, throw it into the pot, cook it out for about 5 or 6 minutes, then add water until it reaches the level of the veg. Add two or three stock pots or cubes. Now, you can cook until the veg is soft. I like to leave it for about an hour and a half. Blitz the soup, taste it, and then season to taste. Now, when the soup is cool, you can stick it in the freezer bags. I like to stick the bag into a bowl, open it out, and just pour the soup in. Now, I'm using a measuring jug here, but a great idea, you can use a, a mug. And each mug is roughly one portion. This has been uh, Cook with Gary. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Stay tuned for lots more videos. Thank you.